I run a nonprofit that teaches people how to de-escalate or calm an angry person in 90 seconds or less. And that we work a lot with schools because of the problems with that uh, are going on with not just students in the classroom, but also teacher to teacher. And one of the things that I run into sometimes is I'll be talking to a principal of a school and they'll say, well, I love the idea, but we don't have to, we don't have the budget so we, I need to talk to my district superintendent where the district superintendent says, I need to talk to my school board to approve the funding. <clears throat> and it always seems like they're now having to take over my role of explaining the program. And even though we have some great material that explains everything and lists the pain points and our solutions, right. it, it we start getting into this. Well, tell you what, go ahead and send us a proposal. Right. And then I'll talk to my, my superintendent about it and get back to you. What would you suggest as an alternative to that's, that doesn't always work well. Sometimes it does, but most of the time it doesn't. You know what? Is there something we can do to, can we create something to mail to the superintendent that replaces you being live? Because yes. see, where, where the degradation starts is when you're out of the process and he, your principal has to go up to superintendent and now the message is, is deflated to like 5% of what you just did with the principal, right? Because you're not there. Yeah. <laughs> and they got politics and they got – so the question is what can we do to capture your clear message that's compelling and a no-brainer that can be transferred up the chain without you being there? That's that's the real question that we have to solve because if we can do that and make it easy for everyone, then the whole goal is to not have each level sell the next level. The goal is to have the first level say, can we ship you something – that is compelling to look at that would, you know, solve this problem. And I'm thinking for you, in your case, it might make sense to develop and create, like I have one of those video book, video books hmm. where it's so novel and so different. And in there is a video of you with case studies, stories, whatever it might be, maybe even do a custom one for each deal. Hi, I spoke hmm. with, John, and you have, you've had seven incidents so far this year with teacher-to-teacher -teacher conflicts, and we have a way to solve that problem that lowers your risk. Like, and it's a it's customized video because you can do that for each one of them. And you create a few, and you have those mailed out to each level, and that should loosen the grip on the process. That's a great idea. And that would be so unique that it would be – it. you used the word compelling, uh, and that would be – that would be a, a, even better than um, I know you have that that book that you hand out your trusted authority book, um, but I think the the video book would be an even even better one. And to pretty much have the same script, each one would make it simple to pump out multiple ones. But you're changing the 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 subtle facts like a name or how many incidents they had, things like that. So it really feels personal to them so that's, that's a great, secret, great suggestion. it can't be generic yeah so you're not you're not working a high volume model you're in a very low volume model you don't need, probably have hundreds you probably have a couple of these a quarter or five a month or something so you can actually customize every single video that matches exactly basically your proposal will be in the video yeah that makes perfect sense Okay. Thank you, Ari. As always, you're a, a fountain of knowledge and, and, and insight and wisdom. I truly appreciate you. Thank Good you. To see you.